It'll be, it'll be a tough one for sure. Having experienced it, what does make Gillette Stadium different in January? Tom Brady. How much better positioned is this team than the last trip up there? You know, you've got Ryan clicking, this offense, yeah. a lot of weapons, uh, the defense as well. It, it, are you all in better position now than that last playoff game? I think so. I think we're a better team than two years ago, but um, every year is different. Our offense is playing really good right now, and um, we have a lot of confidence in defense. So I think that uh, we're a team that's playing well when we need to, uh, but it's a new season, and we got to play well on Saturday. And that's the one thing I did learn from being a Patriot. It doesn't matter what you did. It doesn't matter if it's on a Cincinnati or whatever it, whatever it may be. It's, um, it's one game at a time in the playoffs, and you got to give it all you got. It's not a best of seven. It's not a best of five. That's why football is the greatest sport, because it's the best of one. So whatever team's better on Saturday night, regardless of how last week went or two weeks ago, it's all about on Saturday night, and we'll be ready to go. What makes Brady the best, that he, he's singularly the answer? That... I mean, everything that makes a quarterback good, he's good at. I mean, he's, he's accurate. He's poised. Um, he plays his best in the, in the biggest game. So and he prepares really hard. And obviously, he was a six-round draft pick uh, to have the career he's had. So he puts a lot of work into it. and. Uh, you look it up, whatever word you want to say or whatever stat for a quarterback, he's up there because he's really good. I'm guessing a guy like that is very difficult to confuse with coverages or pre-snap looks or things. So does this just come down to a game where you just kind of have to do your thing and execute as well as you can? For the do, most part? do your job, right? So they'll say it, we'll say it. It's, um, yeah, I mean, we confused them a little bit last year when we played them. But again, that game, I don't know how much relevance it has on this year. So. We're going to run our defense. We're going to do what we do. we got to worry about the Tennessee Titans. I know we're playing the New England Patriots. I know it's Brady. I know it's Belichick. I have a lot of respect for those guys, utmost respect. Like I call them the best to ever do what they do. But we got to worry about the Tennessee Titans, and we got to prepare and get ready to win a playoff game. Is there anything about this Titans team that gives you guys confidence that you will be able to go on a run if anything stands out in particular? Yeah, we're in the playoffs. We earned our way to be here. So we're on the 12 best teams in the league, and we got to we got to go and take our show on the road. and. Uh, go earn some respect and go win some games. So, I mean, um, I th think that's confident enough to be playing football in January. How much do you look forward to locking up with Julian for the Yeah, that'll be, a, that'll be a good, I mean, he's the key to their offense. He's a great player, um, put a lot of work in his career. I know how hard he works. I know how early he's at the facility probably today. And that's someone that I'm always going to be, um, a lot of my work ethic and the things I do, I learned from uh, or saw Tom Brady and Julian Edelman do. And I know if I'm up at 5.30, he's up at 5.30. So we're going to be getting up early all week for each other. As a player, how much of your legacy and your career is determined in January and in February? I don't know. That's a good, that's a good question. That goes to the end all debate. You know, when you talk about the greatest players, is it rings? Is it regular season? I don't, I don't really know. I mean, um, I want to win a championship, and that's why I do what I do. That's why I'm up at 5.30 to win a championship. So I'm just trying to do my best to be ready for Saturday.